Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a come to work vlog with me. Um, you guys will be coming to work with me today. I'm currently trying to get my outfit together for the day. We have dress up week so we can dress up in any type of Christmas attire. And y'all, I got this outfit together like <laughs> yesterday. So hopefully it looks good. What I have is this red shirt. It's like a red long sleeve shirt. Got this from Walmart. And I'm going to cut it down the middle in the front and then tie it. So it's still, it's give because I wanted to give cute, but still like, you know, a little sexy. And then I'm wearing these red fishnets. I got these from Fashion Nova. Then I have these red shorts. These are really short. And I got these from Amazon. So glad they came in time. I got these yesterday. And then I'm wearing my um, regular hooter tights up under the fishnets. And then I found these uh, furry white leg warmers in these arm cuffs from Amazon. So I'm so glad all this stuff came in time. Um, I'm about to try the outfit on now, see what it looks like. Hopefully it looks cute and it gives what it's supposed to give. Oh yeah, and I also have a um, Santa hat. So I'm gonna put that on and then I will be right back. Okay, I'm back y'all. And I have on the outfit and I think it's so cute. I'm gonna show y'all a better angle, but this is just what it looks like right now. Here's the Santa hat, I don't have it on yet, but this is what it looks like. Ah, I think it's so cute. I love this. The vision that I had in my head came out perfectly. The only thing is, I kind of messed up the shirt because I cut it crooked, so it's like a hole right here. I'm trying to tuck it under my bra, but it's not a huge deal. You can't really see it for real. When I get to work, I'm gonna try to tie it a little different, but yeah, I think the outfit came out really cute. I'm definitely gonna take some pictures tonight because I think I look so cute. And then I'm gonna put the center hat on. But I'm gonna wait till I get to work to put the center hat on with it. But this is what it looks like. So my light isn't the best here in my closet, but this is what the fit looks like. Oh, I think it's so cute, y'all. I love this. And then when I put the hat on, it'll be even cuter. So I don't know if I want to wear the hat or if I'm gonna wear like the headband with the ears. I'll show you guys once I get to work because I really don't want to mess up my hair with this hat on. But I think the hat does kind of set off the outfit, so. I may end up wearing the hat. Yay, so cute. Now, I need to hurry up and do what I need to do because I am running late. Usually, I leave my house at 3.30 and it's like 3.45 right now. So, as long as I leave by 4 o'clock, I should be good. But, yeah, this is the fit. Now, let's go ahead and get my scent of the day in order. So, I already have my scents laid out for the day. I'm doing fireside flurries. So... I uh, so I initially got this during the $4.95 body care sale and I had to go back yesterday and pick up the lotion because this smells so good however y'all the lotion does not smell the same as the body mist for some reason the body mist smells better than the lotion but what I'm doing today is the lotion the body mist and then I'm going to layer that with my Burberry hair so that is what we're wearing today I already put the lotion um, on my arms, in my chest, in my stomach, in my back. So I'm just putting it on my hands now. Then I'm gonna do the body mist. And one thing about me, I ain't never too afraid to spray my body mist on me. Like, I'm gonna spray a lot. And then we're gonna top it off with my Burberry hair. I feel like I just smell so good. Let me go ahead and pack my work bag and then we're going to head to work. Oh, and I still have some gifts to drop off to my um, regulars today. Last week, most of them got their gifts, but there are still two of my regulars that haven't gotten their gift yet. And then these two are for my managers. So I'm definitely playing Santa today. And I want to show you guys what I have in their bags. It's so cute. So I decided to get my regulars like the regulars that I've known for years, the one that always come in and see me, that tip me really well, um, that take care of me. I decided to get them something little, you know, something small, just a small token of appreciation from me to them because they're always just so genuinely nice to me and loving and caring. So I decided to give them something 
something small. Um, but this is an example of one of the gifts. This is the bag. And inside the bag, I have a card with a nice little message in it. They have a lottery ticket. Hopefully, they win some money on it. I got some spray from Bath & Body Works. This is the bourbon scent. And then I got the hand sanitizer to match it. And then I got their favorite liquor. Jeff likes Maker's Mark, so that is what he got. And then lastly, just a piece of chocolate. And this is the best chocolate ever, y'all. I love this chocolate. So yeah, I decided to do that for my regulars again because they just show me so much love. And I just wanted to show some appreciation during this holiday season. So hopefully they like their gifts. Like I said, I gave everybody their gifts last week. I only have two people that haven't gotten theirs yet. And then my managers, I'm going to give them their gifts today as well. So um, I need to head out. It is. Oh, crap. It's 346. Okay. I need to be gone by at least four o'clock. So let me hurry up and get this stuff together. Um, I want to crumble cookies, but I guess I'm going to taste the cookies while I'm in the car because I don't have time to taste them right now. And then, yeah, I'm going to see you guys when I get to work. I'm all right, y'all, so I just pulled up to work. I made it in perfect timing. I made it at 428. Even though I left the house 30 minutes later than usual, I still made it here on time. I'm supposed to be here at 430. But I forgot to tell y'all. So right now, it is 48 degrees. It's about to start raining in an hour. So from 5 to from five to 7, it's going to rain. And then from 8 to 10, it's supposed to start snowing. And then when I get off of work at 12 a.m., it's supposed to be 6 degrees. So hopefully that rain does not turn into ice because that's going to be very dangerous trying to drive home and not being able to see like the streets at night. So I'm hoping the weather does not get bad while I'm here at work. If so, hopefully they let us leave early because I can't be driving in it. And also that may affect the business today. I don't know if it's going to be busy. I don't know if we're going to be slow because the weather is, you know, weathering the first day of winter was yesterday and we're already getting snow that's crazy but yeah hopefully overall i'm just hoping for a positive productive good money making shift y'all already know thursdays is my busiest days of the week it's my best day of the week so i'm hoping everybody comes in tonight because i need some more christmas money <laughs> So a quick little check-in. I'm at to work. I'm looking for whatever. But it's currently 8.58, going on 9 o'clock, and we're gonna close at 10. So we're gonna close in an hour because the snow is definitely coming down and that's gonna be dangerous for us driving at nighttime with ice on the ground. So we're gonna close in an hour. Um, hopefully I make some money. I already got a hundred dollar tip. And I got like three twenty dollars tips, so I know I'm already at one hundred and sixty. As long as I make like two fifty, I'll be good. A typical Thursday for me is like four hundred up, but I know I'm probably not gonna make four hundred because we're close early. But I'll check in with you guys in a few. All right, let's see how bad it is outside. But at this point, I'm scared. Oh heck, no! Nah, it's time to go. Y'all, look at that. Okay, yeah, it's definitely time to go home because that's not, that's not safe. So, I'm trying to clean the bar as fast as I can to get people out of here so I can get home because I'm trying to get home safe. I'm trying to restock, clean, cash people out. I only have three people at the bar right now, so I probably can get out here pretty fast. But yeah, this weather is definitely nothing to play with, so. Let me hurry up and stop this bar and clean so I can go home because I have a 30 minute drive. So 30 minute drive plus snow, that's easily an hour, an hour drive. Easy. I feel like my lips look so chapped with that lipstick or lip gloss on, but we're gonna go ahead and get into this money count. I'm separating all my bills right now. Okay, so we have the hundreds, have the 20s, the 10s, the 5s, and the 3 ones. 
All right, let's get into it. So I have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So that's 200. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93. So this is $293. And I only worked four and a half, I'll say four and a half hours. So basically I made $65 an hour, working four and a half hours tonight, which is really decent because we were not busy at all. Again, the weather was terrible. We closed early, so I'm happy that I made this much because I could have walked out <laughs> with $20, $40, $60, but I had a good positive shift. I'm glad that the shift went by fast. And I'm honestly glad that we got out of there early. But while we're at it, y'all, let me show y'all the love that I got today. Like, my customers got me Christmas gifts. I already know what this is, of course. I mean, obviously, you guys see what this is. I couldn't wait to open that one <laughs> because I knew what it was um, when they gave it to me. Um, I know what this one is as well, and I also know what this one is. But this one, this one, and this one, I don't know what these things are, but I'm gonna wait until Christmas to open these gifts up. But I'm just so appreciative of my customers, y'all. Like, they show me so much love, and I'm so excited to open these. Like, I wanna open them now, but I'm gonna wait till Christmas just so I can have something to open. Okay, lastly, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and try these crumble cookies. I kind of want to record a TikTok. Let me see some. Um, yeah, I think I want to record a TikTok as well. Oh. Let me see. Okay. So I have my phone down here, and then I have you guys up here. So I only have um, three cookies. I have the Snickerdoodle, which I already know how that tastes. It's so good. The birthday cake, and then I have the red velvet. One of the cooks at work already took a piece of the red velvet. He said it was really good, but I haven't tried it yet. So let me go ahead and start my TikTok, and we're gonna taste these cookies. We're gonna try Snickerdoodle first, which I already know what it tastes like, but. Mm. So good. It's cinnamon, sugary. It's so, so good. Like this cookie is perfect. I give the Snickerdoodle a 10 out of 10. But Snickerdoodle is my favorite cookie, so I feel like I'm going to give it a 10 regardless. But then again, it's my favorite cookie. So if it was nasty, I would have definitely rated it lower. So I'm getting to 10 out of 10. It's five. It's five. This one is the birthday cake. good i think this one a mm, i'll give this one a nine this one is really good the icing so good the icing is so good on this cookie i'll give that one a nine lastly we have red velvet let's see what this one tastes like and I think it's um, white chocolate chips. Mm. I 
Okay, I'm running out of town, but it's good, but it's not like all that. I'll give this a seven. Seven and a half. Alrighty, so I'm about to shower and then I'm probably gonna make me a little late time snack with some spiked hot chocolates. I made some the other day and it was so bum, y'all. I made it with um the Bailey S'mores Irish cream. It's so good and it's a limited time edition, so it may not be in stores for long. So if you wanna try that out, definitely go copy it now. And I'm gonna put a clip of the hot chocolate that I made the other day at the end of this video just so you guys can see how I make it. So good, 10 out of 10. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I was gonna put, I was gonna record tomorrow, but I don't even know how the weather's gonna be. I don't know if we'll even be open tomorrow for work. So I'm just gonna end the vlog here. Hopefully I was able to get enough footage for you guys. Um, like I said, we weren't busy at all because of the weather. And let me see, it's still, ooh, falling out the chair. It's still, baby. Yeah, it's pretty snowy out there. So, I don't know if we'll be open tomorrow or not. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a happy holidays. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.